welcome back to my channel and it is that time a month again where I like to share all of the things that I emptied up the previous month so let's go ahead and get started with my February empties yay okay there really isn't a lot of things that I kind of finished up in the month of February, but I'm going to go ahead and share what I did use up. Um, I used up the Aveeno Positively Smooth Shaving Gel. I absolutely love this shaving gel. This is something that I would definitely repurchase in the future um, because I like the way that this makes my legs feel afterwards. They would keep them real smooth. It's um, just real soft, and I like the way that it's scented. I used to use like other stuff before, and then I tried this and I've continued to use this. So I will continue to use the Aveeno. Absolutely love it. Um, sticking with along with the bathroom, um, this is the Johnson's Baby Oil. If you guys have been following me for a while, you guys know that I swear by using baby oil in the shower right before I get out. I just squirt it all over my body, kind of let it beat up and roll off, and then I get out of the shower and my skin stays so soft and so moisturized, I hardly ever have any issues with dry skin. So I will always continue to use Johnson's baby oil so I will always purchase this in the future. The next thing that I used up is the L'Oreal Paris Nutri Gloss High Shine Shampoo. This stuff I have been using for quite some time as well. Absolutely love this shampoo. I love the way that it makes my hair look shiny, silky, and it's so soft and it's so easy to comb out when I use it. So I will continue to use the L'Oreal High Shine Shampoo. And then in the shower as well, I shared this with you guys in a haul a couple months back, and this is the Clean On Me Shower Gel um, by Soap and Glory. Absolutely love, love, loved this stuff. And when I was at Ulta a couple weeks ago, I was looking for it, and they were sold out, so I couldn't get it, but I did, yeah. And I ended up getting um, another type of uh, body wash there. Um, but anyway, I love the clean on me. So next time I go into Ulta, I'm definitely going to be getting like two bottles of this, maybe three, just so I have it because I absolutely love the way that this smelled. It just smelled like, it was just like I had like a rich scent or like a very expensive scent and I absolutely loved it. Um, but I will definitely repurchase this again. And, um, I'm sad that I couldn't find it last time, but I love this stuff. Okay, then um, with hair products, I ran out of the L'Oreal Paris Blow Dry Quick Dry Primer Spray. Absolutely love this stuff. I use this stuff every single day. This is something that I will definitely continue to use because I just spray it in my hair when it's wet and when I section it off to either um, straighten it or when I section it off to curl it. Um, I just section each piece off and I blow dry it and I use this on my hair and it leaves my hair very, very soft, very, very smooth and I love the way that it smells and it makes my hair look and feel. So definitely love the L'Oreal Paris Blow Dry dry primer spray. Absolutely. Okay, so the other thing that I used up in the month of February, and if you guys have been watching me for a while, you guys would know that I am so addicted to the Ultimate Flora Probiotic. Again, I swear by this stuff. I had suffered from IBS, which is irritable bowel syndrome, for many, many, many years. And somebody from my YouTube channel, some subscriber, which I thank you so much for watching um, and telling me about this because I I purchased this stuff back last April and I have been using it ever since and ever since I have been using this ultimate flora probiotic I have not had any issues whatsoever with my irritable bowel this has definitely helped it is a lifesaver for me I cannot go without it it only gives you um, 30 capsules in the container so I have to buy it every single month I ran out yesterday was my last day so I have started a new one today so oh my gosh seriously love the ultimate flora it is a pricey but it's definitely worth it because i have to have it so i'm so thankful for this that's empty 
And then I went through, these are like, I stick around with these for like so long and I use them until like seriously I can't use them anymore. So I had like actually two of these that I was kind of switching back and forth with and trying to get as much out of it as I possibly could. But this is the Maybelline Great Lash Mascara. And like I said, I just kind of use the heck out of this stuff until it's like seriously almost all, like all gone, all gone. Um, and then one was almost empty, so I just kind of continued to use it until it was completely empty. So um, anyway, Great Lash Mascara. I've been using this Great Lash Mascara forever. And I've tried other mascaras in the past, and I always go back to the Great Lash. For some reason, it just works really, really well for me. And um, I like the formula in it. I like the way that it makes my eyelashes look full and long. Um, it doesn't leave it goopy or anything like that. So Great Lash L'Oreal. Those are done. And then, you guys have been watching me for a while too. You guys know that I love the Neutrogena Makeup Remover Cleansing Towelettes. Love these. Keep these in every single place that I could possibly keep them. I keep them in my bathroom. When I come home from work at night, I wash my face with these. I wipe up, take off the makeup with these. And then, um, I keep them in my travel bag as well. So I keep these with me everywhere I go because these are the only makeup wipes that actually work for me. They do not make my eyes burn and they do not leave my eyes red or irritated. These are the the bomb. These are everything and I absolutely love them. Neutrogena Eye Remover. And then on to candles. I burned up my little tiny candle from Bath and Body Works. This one was Tis the Season. Yes, it took me this long to burn this little thing up because it's just so little and I just kept burning it. Um, and it was like left in the bedroom, so I just kind of lit it whenever I um, was in there. But anyway, that's gone. So that was a good scent I liked. It was a Christmas scent, more like a cinnamony type of scent. And then this one was phenomenal. Absolutely loved this one. This one also another one by Bath and Body. This was the Renew and Refresh um, scented candle. I loved the way that this smelled. It did. It really smelled fresh and um, I don't know. Just I love the way that it just made my house smell like fresh and clean and yeah. I would definitely repurchase this again. I love the way that it lit up when it was blue. You could just see it glistening. I hate that you never get to finish all of the wax that's in there because those burn out before you can finish all the wax in there or finish burning it. But anyway, that's what's left over. But anyway, love that one. Definitely would repurchase it again. And then last but not least, I finished um, burning the Fresh Balsam. And this one was also a Christmas scent. It was kind of like a pine scent. This was the Fresh Balsam Scented Candle. Um, fragrance of snow dusted balsam, fir trees, and eucalyptus. And I absolutely love the way this one smelled too. This is something that I would definitely purchase again if they had it. I just like the smell of pine, especially, you know, around the holidays, Christmas especially. But I absolutely love it. And there's another one too that it burnt down and all of the candle wax is still down in there. So it's kind of disappointing that it wouldn't uh, continue to burn down because see, look, a lot of that's left. But anyway, um, that's it. Thanks guys so much for watching. Totally appreciate it. If you guys like or enjoy these type of videos when I share my empties with you um, from the previous month, please leave a comment below and let me know. Also, let me know what you guys used up this month as well, or actually last month, February. And leave me a comment below. Let me know what you used up. And let me know what you guys would repurchase again or you wouldn't repurchase again. And then give me a huge thumbs up if you like this video. And also share it with a friend who you think might like it. And don't forget to subscribe if you are new. Thank you so much for watching guys. Until next time. Bye.